Alright, so uh, this is going to be a quick tutorial on how to upload a ghostly model to VRChat. So the first thing you need is the VRChat SDK 3.0, which you can find on their homepage on VRChat. Uh, you will need this, SDK 3 avatars. Uh, and you also need the Unity, the correct Unity version. Uh, you just click here and it will take you to the correct page. You need this version. This is the current version that VRChat uses right now. So get that downloaded. And finally, you will need the Dynamic Bones assets. This is for the uh, bone physics and jiggle. OK, once you have all that, uh, just open up a new project. I'm just going to name this VRChat upload. Let's create. All right, once you have your new project, just import the SDK and the Dynamic Bones assets first. Very important. Just drag and drop the SDK into this uh, area. This is where all your files goes. Just hit import. All right, next is the dynamic bones. And you can just go to the asset store here. Once you bought the asset, you can easily access here. Let's click dynamic bones and search for it. Right here. And just hit import, import again. Okay. Now you should only have these two assets that you brought in, the VRChat SDK and the Dynamic Bones. Finally, you can uh, import the model package, whatever you have. Lastly, so I am just going to import the ghostly canine wolf and fox. All right, so once you have everything in here, uh, I highly recommend if this is your first time using Unity, uh, get familiar with the navigation tools. No. Uh, so it, right here, this is going to be the, the viewport. That's where you're going to see your scenes, basically. Uh, in here, it's going to show you what you have uh, in your scene, your game objects and all that. So to uh, open up the models that I've uh, set it up for you, um, Let's hit the model folder here. Uh, make sure you hit this. Double click. And I'll just open up the scene for you. So uh, next you want to choose which one you want to upload. So in order to do that, go up on the top tab here. Show control panel. It will open up a prompt menu. I recommend just putting it right here. That way you can switch in between. And just sign in. Okay, once you're at this menu, this is the build menu, is where you select what to upload. So let's say I want to upload this one here. So all I have to do is find Wolf Safe for Work. Should be this one. Uh, what you can also do if you want, you don't want anything obstructing anything, you can simply just hide this by unchecking this here. This just this enables and enables the game object. Same thing. It's it's basically hiding the the object itself. And now you only have this. So when you go in the build menu, this will pop up only for this. And all you have to do is uh, hit build and publish and make sure that there's no errors. If there is and it says auto fix, hit the auto fix. OK, 
Okay, and this will pop up, and all you need to do is just name your avatar. Let's say wolf. And uh, you can also change how the thumbnail looks. And just hit the hierarchy. Uh, go to scene up top here. Uh, VR chat will give you a camera here. It will basically take a snapshot of whatever it's looking at. So I can do it like this. And just make sure it is on private and not public. And just hit this at the end here. This just checks, confirms, and then uploads. And that's basically it. And now you have it on VRChat. So if you guys have any other questions, just let me know in the comment section below. And I'll try to get back to you as soon as I can. Or uh, visit me on my Discord. I'm always there to help out. And uh, thank you for watching.